Hey there, what's up guys, Andrew Waters here, and today I am putting my camera gear and my backpack, because my sister has a track meet today, and the bags are all across right through there, right there, all my batteries are charged, and I'm ready to go, and I'm about to go work on my American flag palettes some more, um, and basically a little update on this, nothing really has changed, but I'm really enjoying it down here. Okay, we have finished this American Flag palette besides the stars. Because we're having a hard time with the stars. Because we bought this stencil right here. And that didn't work, so we bought like these stamps where we'll dip it in paint and stamp it on. And we're going to hope that works. Now the next hardest thing is getting this palette out of the way so I can get another one of these pallets back there. Let's see. Okay, now the next thing I'm going to be doing is moving this palette out of the Okay, so last week when we were doing it, we were using this duct tape right here, but we accidentally left it outside. I'm not sure if it's going to be sticky anymore. Okay, guys, I decided to pick another palette, a different one. I decided to pick this one right here, because that one does not have as much wood on it, so I wanted to get Okay guys, I just finished the first layer. It's looking pretty good right now. One thing I'm very disappointed about is I messed up right there and that's gonna be sort of hard to fix. And I need to put another coating on the bottom. The white's not really sticking to this type of wood really good, but I'm trying and it's gonna look really nice. Okay, I just finished the second layer. It is now drying. It looks really good in my opinion. Now once we get the stars on, it looks really nice. Now I'm about to take this part of the palette apart and make crosses out of it. Okay guys, so far I have this part of the palette busted up, 
I accidentally busted a piece of wood or it split. And right now, so that would be three pieces. But right now I only have two, which will make a cross. And I'm selling the pallets for 30, crosses for 15 or 20. Haven't decided, I'm pretty sure like 15 or probably 20 actually for the labor that it's taking. And I still have a whole other pallet over there that I can bust stuff for crosses. Okay guys, right now I am headed back up to get some lunch. Oh gosh. And I'm just throwing the paint, tennis ball with Paisley for a minute. And let's hope I can find something for lunch. Okay guys, I made some pretty good grilled cheese it looks like, and I'm about to eat lunch. Right now, I'm headed back down here to finish up what I was working on, and I'm going to finish building my cross. Okay guys, right now I'm finishing up. My sister got on to me, so I can't do that anymore. And at 3.15, is now 1.15. We are headed to her track meet, and I'm hoping to get some good footage there. We just got here, guys. Okay, guys, I'm walking right over here where I think I can get some pretty cool shots of my sister running. I think right here might be the spot. Possibly or like somewhere down through there if I can get there. But like the stands is right there.
Okay guys, we are leaving the track me right now. They're finishing up the last relay and it is freezing outside. We are headed home right now. I didn't take any videos for running, just pictures and I'm gonna add those in also.